Hi, welcome to Raw Math. Today I'm doing a series of videos on ratios and rates. All right, for this video, what I'm doing is I have this concentration of cranberry juice to soda water. It is three cups of cranberry juice and four and a half cups of water. And I have all these different extra, uh, different mixtures. Some of them are in cups, some of them are in ounces. It doesn't matter because when you're talking about a ratio, it could be in any label, because really it's just parts to parts. As long as it's cups to cups and ounces to ounces, it doesn't matter what ratio you're using. You could use your cup measure, you could use a quarter cup measure, you could use a gallon, doesn't matter. It's really parts to parts. The question is, of all of these different concentrations, which are the same? Now, concentration means total juice to total liquid. So for this one, if we have three cups of cranberry juice to four and a half cups of water, it's three cups of cranberry juice to three plus 4.5 cups of liquid, which is three to 7.5, which we can either write as a fraction or we can just bring that down to say is 40% cranberry juice. Okay. So for our first one, we have 18 cups of water and 30 cups of mixture. Well, this one's tricky because we have water and mixture. We need to figure out cranberry juice. So we take the 30 cups of mixture. We subtract the 18 cups of water and find out we have 12 cups of cranberry juice. So it's 12 cups of cranberry juice to 30 cups of mixture. 12 divided by 30 is going to be 0.4. So this one is indeed going to be an equivalent match. Now it's not just one, it says which of them. So it's gonna be more than one. Okay, for every cup of water, use one third cup of cranberry juice. So juice to total. So the cranberry juice is one third cup, the water and cranberry juice, so one third plus one, let's see, that's one third plus four thirds, so that's Flip and multiply, one third times three fourths. The threes cancel, so that's really one over four. That's 0 0.25. That does not look like the same. All right, so B does not work. For every cup of cranberry juice, add two thirds cup of water. We're gonna do the same thing we did here, um, but this time, let's see, we have a cup of cranberry juice and we have two thirds cup of water, so sorry, three halves cup of water. So if we add that, one is equivalent to two halves. Two halves plus three halves is five halves. So if we make this a two halves up here, we have two halves times, flip this over, two fifths. The twos cancel, we're left with two fifths, which is the same as 0.4. And Honestly, you could be using a calculator versus doing all of this by hand. I just like fractions. Okay, 30 ounce of the mixture to six ounces of cranberry juice. So six over 30. Well, six over 30 is 0.2, so that doesn't work. The ratio of cranberry juice to water is th <laughs> three to 4.5, three to 4.5. That looks the same, but if we do our fraction, cranberry juice, to water, three to 7.5, that's 0.4. All right, that one works quite nicely. All right, and then for our last one, if 4.5 cups of cranberry juice are used, then 6.75 cups of water must be added. Okay, so cranberry juice is 4.5, water is 6.75, so that's 4.5. 5 over 11.25, which is 0.4. So we ended up with four out of the six being equivalent concentrations. All right, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, like my Facebook page, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks!